Hello children. Good morning. Welcome to today's EVS class. Hope you are all staying safe at your home. Have you enjoyed all the videos? Yes. Have you done your homework? Good. Before moving into today's session, let us start our class with one moral value. Shall we? Yes. Good. Children, today's moral value is courage. Courage is the ability to do something that frightens or fears once. Yes. Courage helps you to overcome the fear you have. Courage means bravery. Bravery means fearlessness. Children, you should have courage or bravery to participate in all the competitions or programs conducted in our schools or in our neighborhood. Shall you? Yes. Children, you must inform to your parents whenever some unknown person threatens or blackmail you. Can you? Yes. If you are having honesty and truth in your words and actions, share courage will automatically imbibe in you. Okay, children? Good. So, always have courage. Yes. Children, in this video, we are going to recapitulate what we had learned till now. First, Nana's birthday. Family. A family is a group of one or more people who reside together and they are related by birth, marriage or adoption. There are different kinds of family. They are nuclear family or small family, joint family, single parent family and extended family. Nuclear family. It is a small family where father, mother and children are living together. Okay children? Have you understood? Yes. Good. Next, joint family. It is a large family with parents, grandparents and children all living together. Next, single parent family. It is a family with either father or mother with one or more children living together. Okay, children. Now, have you understood the variations between different types of family? Yes. Next, extended family. It is a very large family with parents, grandparents, children, cousins, nephew, niece, son and daughter. They are all living together. Next, things which are done together in our family. Eating together, going to temple, playing games, attending functions, enjoying festivals, going to an outing. Isn't it children? These are the things which or done together in our family. Did you all experience this? Yes. Good. Next. Reason for changing family structure. Wedding. Relocation or shifting of people from one place to another due to job transfer. Shifting of houses due to natural calamities like flood, earthquake, tsunami, cyclone, etc. or sudden demise of your family member or your birth of a newborn baby. Next, family tree. It shows the relationship between the different members of the family. Pictorially, these, it shows the relative from different generations in a family. These relations may be paternal or maternal. Yes. Then, Nana's 60th birthday. Here, Joe and Joe's maternal grandfather called Nana. His 60th birthday is celebrated by his family members and relatives. All were enjoyed the birthday and had a lot of fun on that day. A special cake and lunch was prepared on that occasion. Then finally, all got blessings from Nana and Nani. Yes. Next, touch and feel. Second lesson. Our human body is made up of many parts. It is divided into external organs and the internal organs. The organs that are present outside our human body are called external organs. 
the organs that are present inside our human body are called internal organs external organs eyes nose mouth ears hands legs etc are external organs heart lungs kidneys intestines stomach liver pancreas bladders brain are called internal organs next sense organs certain organs in our body helps us to sense things around us they are called sense organs eyes ears nose tongue and skin are called sense organs sense organs are the body organs by which humans are able to see smell hear taste and touch or feel yes ways to take care of sense organs eyes if you have some dust or itching in your eyes wash your eyes with clean and cold water and not rub with your hands okay children yes avoid seeing gadgets like mobile tv laptop and desktop frequently next ears or nose children you should not put sharp things like pins and birds inside your ears avoid cleaning of nose by inserting any object just gently blow the nose avoid poking the nose next tongue clean the tongue with tongue cleaner every day avoid eating food which is too hot or cold okay children have you understood yes next skin how bath regularly avoid using chemical products for your body always use herbal soaps toothpaste and shampoos if you have any skin problem apply neem and turmeric paste yes good children next braille script braille is a system of reading and writing by touch used by the blind it consists of arrangements of raised dots which make up letters of the alphabet numbers and punctuation marks it was discovered by louis braille it does not needs any printable materials yes next sign language a sign language is a way of communicating by using the hands and the other parts of the body sign languages are an important way for deaf people to communicate because they cannot hear any other's voice yes next parts of the plant the plants can be divided into the shoot system and the root system shoot the part of the plant which is above the ground is called the shoot which consists of stem leaves flowers fruits with seeds first stem the stem has branches leaves flowers and fruits it supports a plant to stand upright it carries water from the roots to the different parts of the plant next leaf the leaves of the plant are green the leaf is fixed to the stem by means of stalk the leaf has tiny holes called stomata through which the plants breathe next photosynthesis the leaves are green in color due to the presence of chlorophyll the chlorophyll helps the plant to produce food using air water and sunlight in the presence of sunlight chlorophyll changes water and carbon dioxide into sugars this process is called photosynthesis so the leaves produce food for the plant the leaves are called the kitchen of the plant plant give off oxygen in this process yes next flowers flowers are the most beautiful and colorful parts of your plant the main function of the flower is reproduction that is production of new plants next fruits and seeds fruits contain seeds some fruits have one seeds and some others have many seeds the fruits helps the plants to protect the seeds so the flowers and seeds are very important for your plant next roots the part of the plant that grows below the soil is called root there are two types of roots they are tap root and fibrous root carrot is an example for tap root onion is an example for fibrous root yes next types of plants shrubs small plants with woody stems are called shrubs example rose and tulsi herbs small plants with green and soft stems are called herbs example grass and mint climbers some plants have weak stems they need support of other plants walls or sticks to grow such plants are called climbers example 
pea plant and money plant creepers some plants have weak stems and they grow along the ground they are called creepers example pumpkin and bottle gourd okay children next trees so shrubs herbs climbers creepers and trees are the different types of plants yes next trees a tree is a tall plant with a trunk and branches made up of wood trees can live for many years the four main parts of a tree are the trunk the branches the leaves and the roots so tree is a tall plant with a trunk branches made of wood yes next dadaji trees sonu and meenu are the grandchildren of dadaji they had gone to their grandfather house for their summer holidays dadaji is their grandfather there they had seen mango tree kadam tree gulmohar tree chiku tree drumstick tree and dadaji had told stories about them they had also seen trees along the roadside with beautiful flowers which are looked after by municipal corporation yes next a forestation a forestation is the process of planting trees or sowing the seeds it prevents global warming soil erosion and pollution next deforestation deforestation is the cutting down of trees in a large areas due to deforestation the carbon dioxide level in the atmosphere increased which leads to global warming it also leads to pollution and soil erosion living things need trees and plants to live trees absorb carbon dioxide and release oxygen during photosynthesis which is used by humans and other animals for breathing human uses trees and plants for food clothing and medicine they help us to bring grain prevents and decreases pollution by absorbing harmful gases from the environment yes children shall we recapitulate what we have learned till now yes nana's birthday touch and feel and dada ji's trees we we could recapitulate today isn't it yes children next activity define family explain its types next list out the different types of plants with examples and diagram draw diagram with the help of your pencil right then write a short note about how plants prepare their food next define organs write about its classification and also with diagram children whenever you should draw the diagram use pencil to draw okay children yes children i hope you understood all the concepts clearly i will catch you in the next session of our evs class thank you bye bye take care of yourself